Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how you can buy Ethereum on Coinbase app. Very easy guys, very simple. First thing you want to take a look over here is that on the Coinbase app you don't have to search for the actual tickers of the coins, okay? The main coins are always on top. Bitcoin, Ethereum, Solana, AVAX, okay? They're always on top, they're always right in front of you. So when you decide to pick up the coin that you want to buy, in our case, we're looking at Ethereum, you want to click on the coin itself, Ethereum USD, okay, guys, because you're buying Ethereum with US dollars. The first thing you want to take a look when you actually launch the buying landing page, you want to see over here that the trading interval should be accurate over here. You want to make sure that you are set at the trading interval you usually trade on. The default setting is always one hour. I don't know why it's like that, but you can set your own time frame that you usually trade or usually, uh, you know, at least look at the charts online. This will give you an indication of the most recent or the uh, further away price action. Then you want to go ahead and scroll to the bottom and decide we want to buy or you want to sell. Let's click the buy button and let's take a look what we should do next. The first consideration over here is the type of the order do you want to proceed with. For example, we have a limit order. This means that you most likely going to be looking to purchase the Ethereum below the current prices. If Ethereum currently is trading at 2200, right? You might be put uh, you might be putting your buy order for 2150, 180, something like this. Another financial advice. Then the second option would be the market order, which means that you don't want to wait. You expect a big price swing coming. So you think that it will not go lower. So you want to buy right now. The market order, you don't know exactly what will be the price in which your order will be executed until the, the order is already executed. Because every single millisecond, the prices, as you can see, is moving. So the moment you click buy, it will take a couple of seconds to get fulfilled and then you, you're gonna see the actual confirmation and then you're gonna see what is the price of your order this is usually not recommended simply because you're not getting the best prices but if this is not uh, any of your concern you might proceed with this as well and the last option is the new function which means that you set a price you set an amount of your money your portfolio cash that you want to allocate and when this price hits right even though the coin will continue to move up or down you will be able to log in and simply buy at these prices that you put the stop. Uh, it's very, very interesting function. I, I haven't used it personally, but uh, I think it might have some use case. Again, guys, at the end of the day, you need to remember that trading cryptocurrency, it is always risky and it is always uh, in consideration with particular fees. This is not the stock market where you can trade for free. Here, if you place a buy order for 100 hours of Ethereum, you're not going to get 100 hours worth of Ethereum. You're going to get Ethereum and then you're going to pay a small fee for the transaction. Please always be mindful and pay very close attention to the details before you buy or sell cryptocurrency. For more tips and tricks like this, guys, subscribe and come back for more.